It's time to change the oil in my lawnmower. Got a old, I believe, Briggs and Stratton on it. Just a little 5.5 horsepower, and got the Briggs and Stratton oil. 30 weight. I'm going to use that oil extraction pump and get the oil out of it. And I have to get my 12 volt battery handy. And I check the oil level. I'm sure it probably needs a little. Actually, it's towards the lower end of safe. So I'm going to need to set that oil dipstick aside. I'm going to have to get something to measure and put the old oil in. So I'm going to use this old, old quart bottle and use the markings on it to be able to measure. And let me get the battery. These old lines still have a little bit of oil in it from the last job. I'm gonna have to be careful and hold that. Put this down in here. Feels like it's towards the bottom. You hook up the battery to this old extraction pump. Sorry if it's outside the view here. Positive on the left. Negative on the right. All right. Here it comes. sure that all the oil in the line here from the extraction pump goes through into the quart jar here, a quart bottle. here and that reads 12 ounces so I need to fill up this after emptying it to in the old oil container to go to recycle All right. try to get all that old stuff out where I can see the fill on it up to the 12 ounce mark. Uh, 
Okay. It's right there, about 12 ounces. Put the lid on that. Funnel here. Put the 12 ounces in the mower. At least that's what we got, got out of it. And it was up to the safe margin mark, a little bit low. So we'll see where it's at on the dipstick here momentarily. There. Take a look with the dipstick. A safe margin between the two holes and the hash marks. It's got it on both sides. How about that? And it needs, looks like it needs just a little bit more. Let's see. And it needs a little more. Probably just a hair splash. Takes much. Still needs more. All right. Yep. Right up to the full mark. Ta da. Finish changing oil in the mower. I can start out with mowing my lawn. <laughs> yeah, funny how that works, right? Yeah, I'm saving the old quart here to be able to use as a measuring container. And put this back, everything up, and we'll see you soon.